Um, um, hello there, good sir. It is me. I was uh, the last person who worked there before uh, you took the job, and uh, basically, I'm here to uh, guide you on your first night in a uh, your little job at King Kong's Kingdom that you uh, seem to take. Honestly, I don't know why you take this job. It's uh, it takes up a whole like few hours of your night, and there's not really that much pay involved. It's a pretty scummy company, not gonna lie. Heard it's run by some div called the Blue Lobster Show. Hate that guy. Anyways, uh, there's a lot of things you can uh, expect from this first little night here, including uh, you've got the doors at the side. Okay, actually, I should probably explain. The uh, animatronics in the establishment were never given a proper night mode. So they tend to uh, wander around when the, when the lights are shut out. And they will probably mistake you for a child and will dash into your office in an attempt to keep you safe because they've all been integrated with like this AI system like where they've got a full mapping of the place so they can walk around without bumping into anything and if they find a child in any faculty only rooms a, chi a child being anyone who isn't wearing the official uniform they will take them out of there and that won't be good for you because then you'd be trapped in a room with them and Honestly, it's kind of fine. It's just more of an irritant to get back to the office more than anything. Check the cameras for burglars and such. So, uh, usually, uh, I'm pretty sure I had the blue one. What's his name? King Colin? Yeah, he, him and the green one, Scarab Steve, don't usually activate on the too much. So, uh, you should only worry about the red one, which is Peekaboo Patrick, who will, uh, crawl through the vents and use the main hall to try and reach you. The yellow one, Noodle Norman, should be the same. So on your first night, you only expect those two coming after you. Uh, Noodle Norman was always my favourite. Doubles as a chef and a DJ, and what other establishment has that? And also, you can uh, just check the cameras, close doors, and I think you'll be fine, I think you got this. And uh, just give me a status report of if you've noticed anything weird, like any burglars. Maybe if the animatronics damaged themselves, you could go fix them. Anyways, check cameras, close doors, watch for the, watch the uh, little animatronics, and I think you'll be fine. Send me a report when you when your shift is over. All right, I'm gonna hang up now. There we go.
Hey kids, it's me, Patrick, and I have an exciting announcement. Tomorrow, we are going to be having a new show. I know what you're thinking. We do these fun little shows all the time. But this one, we're debuting a new character. That's right, a new character. His name is Scarab Steve, and he was originally rejected for being a little too scary. <sighs> but don't worry. Guess what? We changed his design up a little bit and fixed him. Now he's ready for presentation. Can you believe it, Norman? Uh, uh. Well, anyways, I'll be seeing you all at the show. Come on, Norman. Let's go get ready. <laughs> Well, see you tomorrow. <laughs>